But you wouldn't be the first ambassador to actually be interested in Burisma. Did you know that in September 2015, then ambassador to Ukraine, Jeffrey Pyatt, publicly called for an investigation uh, into Slavisky, the president of Burisma? This was the Ukrainian ambassador appointed by President Obama in Ukraine. I wasn't aware of that, no. You were not aware of it? No. So you would not be the first one to be mentioning that investigations should be done on Burisma because it happened during the Obama uh, administration. Did you know that financial records show Burisma routed more than $3 million to the American accounts tied to Hunter Biden? I did not know that. Did you know that Burisma's American lawyers tried to secure a meeting with the new state prosecutor the same day as predecessor, predecessor Victor Shokin, who the vice president wanted fired, was announced? Did not know that. Well, we're not going to get to the answer to many of these questions because the witnesses that need to come in and clarify exactly what the Democrats were doing in 2016, you're not, we're not going to be able to visit with those witnesses. And so it's an inconvenient truth that the Democrats don't want to admit their operatives that were dirtying up the Trump campaign using Ukrainian sources in 2016. And they do not want us to get to the bottom of it.